Welcome everyone back to the Crimson 15 Podcast. I'm your host, Crimson 10. And 15 PCA. Native 454. Be sure to follow us on Twitter at C15 Podcast. As we mentioned in our Atari video, uh, Neo Geo is having a mini. Everyone's having minis. Yeah. And ever since the success of the Nintendo Mini, they see that everyone's money. coming back with that retro market. Uh, Genesis is coming out with an official one. Japan only. Lame. It's going to come here. Hopefully. So the SNK Neo Geo had one. Never, uh, when we grew up, I remember seeing Neo Geo cabinets, but they were never my favorite. I didn't like the button layout. Mm -hmm. I always thought it was a little goofy. I always liked six button. Yeah. I grew up with Street Fighter. But Neo Geo has some solid arcade games. And mm -hmm. looks like this mini looks absolutely amazing. Yeah, I definitely, oh. if it's it like a I'd want to get one. It looks like a tiny arcade. And it's it has the, um, because back in the day, a lot of the Neo Geo cabinets, you can choose what game. Like there was multiple yeah. games built in into one. And it was just like, screen. A, it has its own screen, has an arcade stick. That's pretty awesome. And and then also from the other pictures, you can see that it has like a, a USB thing in the back. So you can plug in uh, uh, joy pads, like exactly. regular joy pads. So you don't have to be all crammed up here. You can play from afar. And this is that SNK 40th anniversary collection. And if this can be, uh, looks super legit. Yeah. It's a 3.5 inch, in, inch screen built in joystick controller. So I'm trying to think in my mind. It's, it's pretty tiny, but it's just... Just sitting on your desk, it will look super cool. Yeah. It just is a cool look. I looked at it, guys. It looks amazing. I know they're releasing this now on, on disc form, too. I saw that. Oh, Unfortunately, really? I saw it for the Switch, which is kind of garbage but so far. But yeah. this, and, this looks amazing. And I'm not seeing a price here, but it comes with 40 games. And I'm going to go down the list of games, and we'll talk about the games that are what we remember. Um, it has uh, five King of Fighters games. 95, That's 97, 98, you 2000, only need 98, 2000, basically. And 2002. So yeah. yeah. They're the same games, basically. Because the, I mean, that's a way to pad out the thing is to put yeah. tons of versions of Kings of Fighters. Even I'm not Art of Fighting guy, either. Art of Fighting's on here. Yeah. Fatal Fury Special. Fatal Fury Real Bow. Mm -hmm. uh, the Mark of the Wolves, which is probably the worst. For, I, I don't like it. I tried playing it. It's so hard. Yeah, that's the yeah, that's the one where... Um, where Terry has the brown jacket. Yeah. Yeah, they got Samurai Showdown, which is a fun fighting game. It's all right. It's um, yeah. It has some cool characters. Um, Mine, mine's out chick with the hawk. I forgot her name. Is it Mikuru or something like that? Is it Hibiki? I forget. I forget her name. One, yeah. two. So let's just go down this. So that there's the one, two, three Samurai Showdown games. Mm -hmm. uh, Last Blade 2. Uh, World Heroes Perfect, which was like a complete rip of Street Fighter. There's a guy, football guy. He's a funny. He's my favorite because he just and guy. like the the girl, like she looks like Chun Li. Yeah. And like this, it's it's such a Street Fighter clone. It's ridiculous. Uh Kinzawa Encounter? I have no idea what that is. The then, then we have the Metal Slug games. Which yeah. are fine. Excellent uh, arcade -y left to right. Uh, start on the left side of the screen, go to the right side of the screen, kill everything. I love when you save the hostage, they salute you. <laughs> salute you. Yeah. And, then you and then you get in the, there's lots of vehicles. So that's it's a fun shoot em up. Super hard, designed to steal all your yeah. quarters. You're finding generic uh, Nazis and you go to aliens. <laughs> For some reason, you start finding aliens at the end. That's the problem with SNK games, is that they do this rubber band effect like no one else. Oh, the first couple levels, oh, they're really easy. Then you get to the very end, and boom, it snaps back. There, there's a reason why all the Metal Slug games on the home consoles have a finite continuance. There's no way you'd be able to beat them. Same thing with King of Fighters, Samurai Showdown, the so last tough. parts. Oh, goodness. So, um, then it goes into King of Monsters. Awesome. Love. Mm -hmm. It's a... Wrestling Battle Royale game. Yeah. Yes. I guess it would be the best way to do it. So just imagine King Kong, Godzilla, Jet Jaguar, just rip off some yeah. of those characters. And it's yeah. funny, they're like big, large, and they're like in arena. It's so funny because it is an arena because it's the city. It, but it's a city, but it's like, oh, the power plants are making two electrical wires. Going you can bounce off, yeah. bounce off them. So it's like a and ring. I don't want to say, isn't there like an Ultraman guy yeah. there? It's in the game. Oh, there's a Godzilla and rip off. There's like a wrestler who looks like a large type wrestler guy. Yeah. There, there's like a goop monster, so yeah. it's very a uh, kaiju monster movie. Yeah, which is really cool of the week, yeah. And it's cool and movie of the week, too. I also, the thing is, I, when every time I get paid, I'm like, you know, I see King of Fighters available to buy for download. Like, there's one, but it's like $8. I'm like, I, don't want to, I never buy it, but yeah. I always get tempted to buy it because I love that game. Um, Shock Trooper, Second Squad, but don't... I if, barely remember If I that. saw that, I would probably notice. Um, one I can't pronounce, Shin Goku 3. Ninja Masters, another uh, side-scrolling beat-em-up, yeah. really cool. Uh, top players golf. Never been a golf guy mm -hmm. for games, but that's it's not there. Mario Golf. I don't play it. Super Sidekicks. I don't remember. Blazing Star, Star. I do. That was fun. Uh, puzzled. Probably a puzzle game. Yeah. Then we had some more Metal Gear. Uh, uh, Metal Gear. Metal Slug Slug. games. Uh, Magi uh, Ma Magician Lord. Great game. I want to see if anyone can beat that on one sitting in arcade. People Never. can do it. Oh, I God, guarantee you there's somebody old. out there. Because you're playing for like eight hours. It's like a regular game. Um, and uh, the first King of Monsters, both were really good. Yeah. Uh, Blue's Journey. I'm, I'm drawing a blank that. on that. Yeah. Uh, Shock Troopers, one and two are on here. Uh, Robo Army, Cross Swords, 
Mutation Nation, Three Count Bout. Uh, there, was that another wrestling I game? I think it might have been wrestling. Or was yeah. that a boxing game? I forget. Yeah. You know, the wrestling is like the characters are really big though, and the rings are kind of small. If I remember, mm. I haven't played it in a long time. Last Resort, Ghost Pilots, and Football Frenzy. So if you like fighting games. Yes. This has a ton of fighting games on here. Which some I, good, some old okay, ball average. Um, I I would expect there to be some more uh, of the um, top down shooter games. Oh yeah, and the side scrolling mm-hmm. shooters. Yeah, yeah, I didn't see any of those on here. Maybe they were trying to stick to first party Neo Geo games. See, because Nintendo's console had games made by all kinds of developers. Yeah, yeah. Konami, mm-hmm. Square. This looks like there's a lot of just Neo Geo. I think SNK. the Neo game is the one where you're there. You could be two ninjas and the side scrolling beat them up. And you can get power ups to get super strong. If I, I, I remember Ninja Masters like that. Yeah, I think that's what it was. I'm trying to remember in my head, top of my head. But yeah, I mean, if, I, if this thing is the right price, I would love to get it. I'm double checking this article for a price. I'm not seeing anything. Yeah. Uh, I hope it's only. Yeah, hopefully, it's not just only available in Japan. That would kind of be a downer. Well, and also, I would say what, what price range probably what forty to sixty. You think? Oh no! Oh, this is gonna be like two hundred bucks. It's gonna be one hundred fifty. Because just thinking. because this thing looks like a little mini arcade. Oh, if it didn't have its own screen. That's the screen true. is probably going to jack up that price. See, you're thinking Nintendo Mini prices, no, but no. if the Nintendo Mini had a flip up screen, that thing would be like 150. A low end's going to be 150, high end at 250. And hopefully, this Ooh. gets a worldwide release because if it's a Japanese only thing, then the price is going to it's going to become a unicorn. It's going to be rarer than rare. Yeah, yeah. Not gonna, no and way. It's going to be like that. They'll a thousand bucks. No, they'll, yeah, they'll be 200 something, and then they'll, and they'll jack it up to a thousand, like you said. And I wonder the if scalpers. they're if they're using arcade parts in. Uh, the Shenhua, whatever parts for the arcade. Yeah. Like, <laughs> that's very, very important when it comes to fighting games. Any fighting game aficionados know you got to have the right kind of parts. The yeah. button's got to feel right. You, and if it's super janky, if just thrown together arcade stick, it's going to suck. Even even Mad mm-hmm. Cats has some hit and misses with their arcade sticks. sticks. Yeah. But this thing, just from an aesthetics point of view, it's a home run. Yeah, can you, uh, can you, I can literally just play this. If I like a game room and I put it in the middle, I put it in the middle of my game room like a display thing because it yeah. looks... Looks amazing. Well, even uh, even the art for the thing it shows like the little uh, thing you put over the cabinet, so it makes it look. It like... has all the different games on top. Yeah, yeah. So no, the nice. the Atari one it looks like that was just put together. Oh, we have an old one, and we'll just put some things on. No, this actually looks like they took the time to make it look cool, from, and different. From mm-hmm. what I'm looking on the console, it only has one controller port. So if you were gonna play two players, one would have to play with their arcade stick, and one would have to play with the joypad. Mm. Which I guess is fine, yeah, but okay. it would have been nice for both players to be able to play the same. But that's before. that's fine. I mean, it's it's really it has HDMI out, so you can plug a new TV. Yeah, so if you don't have to plan that, as those thing, hopefully there's that because then you can play on a bigger screen. Yeah. yeah, so you don't have to be all. But um, yeah, this is definitely pretty cool. I love the the looks. I'm in love with the looks. Yeah, it's great. Ten that out blue, of ten. That light blue. It's so oh. Neo Geo. Mm-hmm. Oh, it's perfect. So and they took their time. Like this is something you want. Oh, I wonder if you could change the marquees out. That'd be fun, too. Yeah, hey, that'd be easy enough to do. Oh, yeah. I mean, seriously, I mean, just a yeah. double-sided tape and a printer, yeah. right? But I'm pretty sure there'll probably be official, like, once yeah, you can yeah. lock in. But, yeah, definitely, um, we'll keep an eye on this. If a uh, price comes out, we'll do an update video. But um, definitely, Neo Geo, from nostalgia, this thing is pretty cool. Yeah. Oh, yeah. And we're not even super dire Neo Geo fans. We only like a handful of its games, but this looks incredible. Especially for that. Uh, yeah. It brings back all that arcade yeah. feel. Yeah. If this was 200 or Atari, what would I get? I don't get this. this. Yeah. No, I'm sorry. Yeah. Even though it only has 40 games, and I bet you for someone's going to be able to hack and you'll be able to get like a, a USB in the back and you get more games on yeah, it. Yeah, it's like SK. But you'll have access to more games, <laughs> like the store. <laughs> <laughs> all, all you can go in the car and drive and get things. Oh, I didn't know I could do that. Thank you. I'm glad that SNK, like you know, looked at the whole Nintendo thing. Was like, you know, what, let's do it better. Let's yeah, do so it, it, let's do it our way and better. This had this the whole cabinet. The look is distinctly Neo Geo mm-hmm. SNK. This has a also, flavor. This, it's just from the way it looks, it crushes Nintendo and Super Nintendo. Just for just visuals, look. Yeah. maybe not games, but the way it looks. It's not even close. And if the build quality is up there, this thing's gonna. Be, I think it will be a home run, especially with the Neo with the retro fans. Because yeah. we all remember growing up going to arcades and at least seeing SNK cabinets. And there's yes. a problem if you want to get physical Neo Geo games. The price went down for like 10 seconds and then went back up again. And it's never been cheap ever since. Yeah, the, the console was like $700 when it it's first insane. came out and the games were like 150 And it's still yeah. that, almost that price now. Because it's, it's just, basically an arcade. Yeah. yeah. And also I'm so glad for SNK. They're, they're still trying to make games. They're still trying to be that uh, video game company, which is awesome. They well, still have some cool properties. You yeah. know, the King yeah. of Fighters and now that's a cool property. Slug, yeah. yeah. So try. definitely uh, keep an eye on this. If the price is something ridiculous like 600 bucks well, hopefully it's hundred dollars would be amazing but yeah, I doubt it's, gonna be, I, it's gonna be 200 yeah and 200 plus i i would love to get them if they, if they have them like at my walmart i might just have yeah 
Man, I would love to. I, I definitely would. I wish there would be like a display. I just want to fill the buttons and the joystick. Because if the buttons are nice and the the arcade stick is working well and it has really good movement, then it's worth the price. If it's janky and cheap, and this thing weighs like two pounds, yeah. it needs to be kind of heavy. Yeah, it, I, might, got, I, yeah. I won't even mind a five pound. Five yeah, it needs that needs to have some weight to it. So you, have to, when you're going in playing a fighting game, you're not going everywhere with. Yeah, it, it just yeah. flies across the room. Woo. But nothing's better than that intro screen in Neo Geo. Da, na, 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 128 bit. Da, na, 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 na. I know, that's when I actually meant something. <laughs> bits, baby, all about the bits. Crimson Sin here. Thanks for watching and be sure to like, sub, and share. Also, for the most up to date information about the podcast, follow us on Twitter at C15Podcast. <laughs>